Boma ne gen tek ene moulu no posi geta asukam kuechiri yazelo. Once again, good morning, good afternoon, good night. It depends your time. And your location, your general student at Eastern News 24. We have to give to you the latest news on what is happening in Biafra land. All right, I did go to Naga. I got up on your Sunday five well in Ogadelo. I have been finished in Obuabo. One night walking, Kabume, Mazume, over the four well. Okawase, but but the time we refer, many no na protest eme na aba, and also the issue of IPOB in South Africa. Agwe na hota, so nsika ndi biafra geya biife, geya biife then unu gecha kwa niya unu kabalo tia niya lo ifa yeme, and ifa yeme kowe dema alu unu matase lot. Because in this platform, we give everybody opportunity to say their mind. All right, um, over to you, Mazi Ume. Over to you, sir. From the onslaught that went on in Aba, and we say no to that. This man must be held accountable of their heinous crime in Biafra land. As I go forward in this program, I will be showing you the facts about how they have compromised the lives and the security of our people by that single act of treachery against our leader, an IPOB at large. Now, when what took place in Aba took place on 31st, I did program on that same 31st. As I said, I will not comment on this issue until we ascertain what happened. Because when we say things, we don't forget them. I want you to quote me right when you want to quote me. And I came back on fort and I laid it to bed. I told you what happened. And as I'm saying tonight, Chino Samuel came on Radio Biafra and was gravitating around and said, misogynist, talking things that make no sense, blame the death because yeah, we are, they, all this was calculated and something that was masterminded, including their earrats and their media worms. After they murdered Akwara Wamende, they held a secret meeting, saying nobody will talk about this. But I want to review one thing to you tonight as well. As you all know, the vegetable himself that are leading the Af uh, Biafran community came on Radio Biafra after 15 days of this particular, you know, murder. And he was so, you know, vulnerable that he couldn't even hold a two-minute or one-minute silence for the death. He's playing games with the life of our people. Because he was the masterminder, which is a Ram boy that lives in Kuwait, they call Chinas and Samuel, the faceless monk that lives in so called uh, desert that's sniffing dust there on a daily basis. He never mentioned what happened in Abba. What does that tell you? And it was hidden. That was not in the camera like I'm talking to you now. I've always said it. Onion do speak Onion do the kind of talk, so, talk to us on camera when he's doing Facebook Live. He's on Radio Biafra. I don't know if he doesn't know how to operate, you know, being on, connecting from studio on being on the radio. You don't, you don't have to hide your face. Other people, even those that are claiming that they are leaders, they are all of them, their faces out there. Why are you hiding your face? Not coming out because as I'm talking, you can look, at, look into my eyes and you can see. I'm not fringing. Because I, oh, what I'm saying here is something that there to me. I have a lot to do to devote this time and my own time and my money to be doing what I'm doing. But Chike Dozem has no balls to even to mention that those he claimed that he was leading were massacred in our back. But I want to tell you something tonight. Like China Samuel claimed that uh, he called his uh, so-called HND, informing what was going on. All these are lies. We have sources. Matter of fact, Chike Dozem made a personal call to Akwara Wamende. You know, sometimes when people are lying or you're playing games with people, it's not, it cannot get your way all the time. Um, who sold Abba Fendi to them? Where was the fund, resource for that Jagatin, Jagatin, Jagatia uh, project went through that they saw all, no amount of men that were on the street that they were wearing same white, only Akwara Wamende was wearing black which is, is, a, is a target. But I can tell you now, 
that Chike Dozem made a call across Akwalao Mende, told him that they want this to be peaceful. Chike Dozem told Akwalao Mende that I want this protest to be peaceful. Because Akwalao Mende was a humble servant. I have been a victim of these monsters. In United Kingdom here, when they set up Umwada, the fake Umwada that come to United Kingdom, I know what it cost me. I will tell you on a very good day. Some people that are close to me know what happened in UK here. Even though I was the only person that questioned the meeting, the para meeting, Okachi called. Okachi was not UK national coordinator. And I told him in his face, I don't play games. I fought for Okachi in United Kingdom. But I told him in that meeting, I said, Okachi, you have got no right. After Onyendu have made you the head of medical corps, director of medical for the first time, and which I don't know what he's doing with it today. And you call it a parameter where we we'll have a new national coordinator in the United Kingdom. All this thing we are following command and control. After that, I still went through to try to contribute mine to make sure we facilitate this to go forward. I know what happened to me. So Apala Wamende was one of the humble servants following command and control. Chikorosem told him, I want this to be peaceful. I will tell you today that when the Zoom murderers were killing our people, they took off their shoes. What does that tell you? Our people, you guys know what I'm talking about. When our people, when they call them in the middle of between Walod and Osisoma, where they have two barracks there, where China Samori's family members are residing as I'm talking to you. This man took off their shoes when they were shot at our people. This man was unprepared. But guess what? Cindy, Chisom, 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 Chisom Dream Peters was on the background telling them that this is Iba State, Iba State ESN Command. You know, in collaboration with I, IPOB, marching for their leader, which I'm going to play her voice here. And there's another man there saying the same thing. Chike Dozium could not mention the death. And some of you are playing games with the life of our people. I will speak Igbo for one thing in this program. Add the Juna Juna Banya, or just sin a yaji or four. It's Guajani or four Buncasa Tasata. Conan on Kenyan and Nagonan Naginagi. Pardon me for using this language because this is very, very deep. Chike Dozium and his gang of criminals. It's your four, open it your four, it's Guajani. I want you to go and ponder to this war tonight. But I want be upfront to know that Chike Dozium set up our people and murdered them in a cold blood in Aba with his collaborator, Ch Chinan Samoru. With the same girl, they call Chisundrim. I will mention their name here. All this, you know, this, uh, they call them uh, Umu, Umu, Umu Doom writers. It's a bunch of riffraffs. Because I remember when Umu Chuku writer was formed up. That's why I mentioned Ezekwesi, but Ezekwesi fell when Uchemofo left IPOB. I made my investigation and I found my finding. He's a gentleman. I spoke to him. He lived in New York. He was the first person that interviewed Onyendu under Umuchuku writers. When Onyendu went to New York. We are here. We're not going anywhere. We'll give you facts and figures. So all these three facts, I'm going to mention their names. These people are the people that China Samuel is using in our back. China Samuel have done indescapable, indescapable things in our back and of axis, including Olu. Why have you asked yourself, why is it that Olu is on rest? All these evil men we have within IPOB, all of them are from there. They have sworn. That's where when Omi Omi cried. Omi Omi made some references on what has happened. So because what they did was they want to divert our attention. They forgot about what happened in Aba. We say no to wait. We are going to hold them in accountable. Let them not forget that we are living in a very civilized world. I said, I will always refer you guys to what happened in Liberia and Sierra Leone and those bad consequences. I just wanted to let you be, I will play the audios, you know, as when I'm getting to where I'm going to play them. I'm not going to play it now. But I will still remind you of what transpired in Aba tonight because at the end of the day, it will never go away. Now, um, I just want to let all you guys know that, you know, the zoo are trying all their best to make sure they dehumanize our leader. Over time, I said, I'm as a man, if he was sent by man, personally, I, George Rumeau, will not budge. The day I had only those voice, gross bomb was all over me, and since that day to today, I have never ever anything that concerned me. No, no man preached Biafra to me. Someone said, listen to the Radio Biafra. I always say this. 
And those that United Kingdom leader I took over, that was what I said. I say it all the time. Get that video out there and understand who I am. I don't play. Whatever I say today, wake me up tomorrow morning, I will be saying the same thing. So the tuberculosis outbreak in DSS is intentionally targeted to our screen leader. When you're in the kind of by the so-called presidency, but at the end of the day, um, we know what they are doing. And um, our leader will come out triumphant at the end of the day. And that thing I want to say again today, there was uh, this court in, uh, in a Supreme Court of the, you know, but anybody saying that is secret. I don't know why. Every little team, this is refrasted, we want to turn it into propaganda. We, we are aware of what's going to happen and we know, we know what was going to be the outcome. All the value they've passed, what have they done with it? Nobody should come here and tell us about uh, Zoo law court because Onyendu has even United Nations Working Group has sanctified our leader to be, you know, discharged and acquitted. The one good news I have to comment is about uh, uh, the Idiara Gold. This same, our sister that came from the same, I think is from the same place, Aqua Women, they came from. Um, there is some people and we must respect them. My sister, we welcome you back in a mix of. Um, the hard cause because you have paid the ultimate price and that is the reason why we're doing what we're doing here we're defending those that have paid that price of honor your name shall be right in the gold as our leader said now um i want to say something here because over time um people don't really realize uh, how far these men have gone there is something that has been trending and I want you to connect the dots. What happened in Abba is something that have happened even when Onyendu was here. In, within the structure of IPOB, this man has been playing these dang gods among themselves. For some of us, it wasn't clear to us what was happening because of the command and control. You know, we've been put on and we still respect it tomorrow morning and our code of conduct. When they cannot blackmail you and you don't succumb, two things will happen. Is that they, like, like us that are in our blood, they will spell you without even giving reason for that. But the people in Biafra land, what do they do with them? Is either you, uh, you do what they ask you to do or they will send the SS after you or they will eliminate you. And China Samoru has been doing this perfect because we have it in audio. You know, it's, like I said, whatever they have said is what we are using against them. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't come here to, 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 to fabricate my own words. What I do is that I, I take out what they have said and when they said it, and I will give it to you. Now, the so-called Umu Udala writers took it upon themselves and tried to blackmail a young lady that was a hardcore and that was involved in IPOB uh, security architecture in Biafra land. That have worked us seriously because we're our sources. We don't just come out and say things because we are media outfit and most of all, I believe to take responsibility of my own words anytime, any day. I want to make something abundantly clear here. Neche, that young lady, all of us remember that. And suddenly we didn't see her again. One time, I think I read something above, she was saying that DSS was training her. And sometimes again, they carried a smear attack on her on, on, on that she was in somewhere in Lagos or whatever, um, um, on TikTok. But do you know why they did that then? That was the old pictures that that young girl that have life over her. Even though she's enjoying in the beach, what, aren't you enjoying where you are? What does she have to do? She's a young kid. That's your child abuse for crying out. That's it. Even if in the real world, they will charge you for child abuse. For allowing that girl to get involved in what we are doing. It's a child abuse on her age in that time. I want to make it clear here. Baby soldiers in Sierra Leone and Liberia, people went to prison for it. Guess what? The propaganda. On Neche. Chuku. Neche. Is a cover up of China Samoru on his atrocities, activities in ESN in Aba. No, you know, 
what we are seeing now is a piece of what this guy have done in our back. She knows some old families member. The one that still left there lives in the barrack in our back. Is an Ngba man. Is an Ngba man. Neche knows a lot about China Sangoru. Sabotage and the killing of ESM. Commanders and lying against them. This is our sources. China Sangoru come out to deny whatever I'm saying tonight. And what Neche knows. We don't know where she is. But what I'm telling China Sangoru, China Sangoru, don't forget. If you guys are threatening that young lady's keep, um, um, families back home, we are not living in a archaic age. Every single thing you guys have done is on record. Mark my word somewhere. Mars and can never groom ESN to turn the gun against of our people. But they have done so and they have come out publicly and threatening people. All these things are on record. Propaganda and blackmail are China's and world alternative weapon to silence those he couldn't kill or hand over to DSS. I want you to quote me right. All this I'm telling to you tonight is I say it. If they said it. If they don't hand you over to the police, then um, 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 they will cut off your balls. I will play their voices here. It's not me that said it. It's what they said. Now, Cindy, Cindy Peters and Amarachuku, Debbie and Umuchuku, devils, are working for China Samuru, the black man, the check. After helping him to disappear, Akwarawa Mende, and kill over 50 others. Aba Masaka. The chair will definitely speak when the time is right. China Samuru, you don't need to shit on your pants. Because uh, when you guys carry smear attack on her, and showing her pictures in, in, uh, in what's it called, that she had on Instagram, this is her private life, is because you want her to come and be talking and be ranting on social media against the formation you guys have created to distract attention. There's no any hardcore IPOB member will be distracted. We came out and fought those we thought that we were enemy, but we never know. That's why when I told you guys, because some of us, we don't forget things. When we say things, a lot of people might take it out of contents, but we don't lie again. I don't gossip. Anybody that knows me know I don't gossip. Come to me talking rubbish at back. I don't listen to you. When I when the day I called China Sangwolu, I called uh, the day I, I said China Sangwolu has a pathological hatred where only it is. It was taken, all of them was taken shot at our leader. One day he came out and openly said that only suspended into Chikedesium. My word confirmed. It was confirmed. There was no there's no if. Now, again, as they are now moving forward, they thought all of us, they will bamboozle all of us to one corner. And when I told you that Chine Chikedozem was the enemy at the gate, then I refer you back to Onyendu, I think second to the last or third broadcast he did, that every single one of us should go and watch the enemy at the gate. I said it to people. But today, everything we have said have come to pass. One thing I want to let the friends know is that <laughs> when you see these people pointing finger on somebody, know there's something about that person. That young lady, whatever she is, we could carry her will be with her. But the ones that are still in our back, and uh, they're giving 2,500 naira to carry smear attack on someone that's not in your lead anymore, will be tired of you. And to blackmail somebody. And every single one of you that are going after this girl for no reason, don't forget, your own family, they are not hanging on the tree. They are not in the tree. When you, when you start killing people, you all you've invited is an anarchy. No man is a monopoly of violence. When you turn the gun against your own people, it will move boomerang. Mark my word somewhere. So I'm signing it as a warning tonight. China Samuru and your gang of criminals, all this riffraff you have in Alpha, all this Umuchuku, Gota Media rubbish. Including all this useless Yemeka gift, all these are a bunch of idiots. Family writer, remember when they fought with Chimofo? That's why I want, that's one thing I, that's one thing I respect about with Chimofo. And I'm saying it today. Despite that they fought with Chimofo to the new physical and spirituality, they confused his head, twisted his head. All the fraction in IPOB that brought problem today in IPOB, Chimofo kicked against it. In United Kingdom here, 
when they created no more as about about women about women now which of us said no that we don't want fraction within ipob we don't anti i stand on that if somebody's answering on top of my law these are fractions there's no name any name that does not resonate with ipob count me out of it and that's why we have problem today because these people bring their own outside agenda within ipob if you have something that's why only you say bring the spirit argument if it's good we accept it but not bringing your own you know in window into what we are doing and that's what i brought us only do give that open that door and look where we are today i don't blame him because our leader is blemish mazin nanikan is a is a girl is good as diamond the tomorrow morning that's nothing like him and if you miss this opportunity our generation we i don't know what they will call us so i want to move forward tonight like i said the blackmail, the cabal is kind of against nature. They are wasting of their time. And the young lady will speak whenever she will speak. That is what our sources told us. And take it to bank. Those that are striving, try to kill themselves. Know that whatever China Samoru, China Samoru, all the crime he committed in Abba, he will answer to it. And beyond. Including Chikadozim, because that must be accomplished. At the end of the day, all of you will be judged together. I will move on. Now, there is something that happened, I think, yesterday in South Africa. And first of all, I have to thank my comrades in South Africa. IPOB worldwide in South Africa. IPOB, uh, one family in South Africa. You guys have done us proud. And um, I must commend uh, Maz Innocent uh, Anya uh, as a comrade. Um, the reason why I have to touch into this tonight, because when I told you that China Chike Dozem is an enemy of the gay, people don't understand. I have said this before. You know, in this world, when something does not happen to you, when he found for sound information, he must treat you with care. Before Onyendu was renditioned, United Kingdom scheduled our women to be doing protests in front of Number 10 Diamond Street. Before our leader was kidnapped. And United Kingdom started that protest when we are doing it on a daily basis. Even it brought problem because some people don't know how to manage things and they don't listen. Guess what? Those protests was boycotted by Austin Abani. Because Austin Abani, that new tweet, is the one actually engineering. Because Chike Dozem doesn't come out and speak like he told you. What is a snake? is the most dangerous human being you want to deal with on this planet Earth. You see me? I hate people that he doesn't speak. Any man that doesn't speak, run. They will kill you and still laughing. They boycotted all those processes. And there is no country that has protested more than the United Kingdom since our leader was arrested. Since our leader was extraordinary rendition. The United Kingdom. is on record. But I want you. That is why when they wanted UK media, we look at those monks. Everything is on record. Mazen Nandekan will come out alive. We are not arguing here. But the truth is that what happened in South Africa? What happened in South Africa have opened everybody's eyes. That Chike Dozem will go to the far to block Onyendu's doing Onyendu's protest. But people we are using IPOB name to respond. Chike Dozem never moved muscle. But they will go far. What did I say to you? They do not want Mazen and the Kali to come out again. They have written our leader out. China Samuel Chike Dozem, Austin Aban, Isaiah What is his name again? This one, I don't, I don't mention Isaiah, Isaiah is nobody. I'm calling uh, this one the head of media, Chukwu, your former, the so-called deputy leader, uh, deputy DOS. I don't mention this clown, this man. But as all of them are kaba, none of them want Mazen and the to come out again, and they are beating our leader out. That is why they went this far. I hear somebody saying, "Are you still hearing about United Kingdom?" Let me say this to some people that clown that don't know. If you can go to company's house today and type IPOB World YCIC, you will still see Sophia Kano as, director, as, as a director there. You will see so Sophia Kano is still a director there till tomorrow morning. We left all these things that way it is. But what I'm saying for those that don't know, what does that tell you? Secretary made herself a director in somebody's company. I owe company in UK. I know how it runs. Because these people... They gave you information to come and talk. You're looking at you when you're talking. You have never been part of it. You don't even know what has happened. But I have to give my accolade to our comrades in South Africa. They did us proud. 
But this has shown you how Chike Dozim and his gang of criminals, one man has not known the canoe released from the SS dungeon, ASAP. They lied that the SS poison onion do. They attend the SS poison man has not known the canoe. And this said this clown they call him. All right. Dalon Linne, Dalon Linne, Dalon Linne Kunse Sailai. Open the final men at Eastern News 24 and do no more about share and comment on the comment section below. Once again, what do you have to say concerning this audio? You know, you just listen to right now from our Ebo Biafra. Maze Ume, careful for the Kikunia, Ian Kogola. Now, don't forget to drop your own comment on the comment section below. Stay tuned. More news update still they come on the way at Eastern News 24. In the bye. Nova Dalun, Kemesia, Nova Sinketa.